So let's continue to create the, the button for the view for the for this page. To create a button, we were using GUI button in here. Again, direct is the same idea. We will put this button under the game title, or actually in the center of the page. So we will put width divided to and the screen width screen height divided to and the size will be 128 by 128 again because we want to put it in the center so we need to minus 64 in each and because it's a button so there will be something different compared to the GUI label in the rector here, we are going to use something different. We put uh, an empty for the string in here, and uh, we will call it play btn, which means uh, play button. And go back to the front. We need to put an if in if statement in here. The reason why we need to put that is because this is a button. So we need to let Unity know if someone put the but, uh, push the button and uh, allow and tell him tell the Unity to do something. So we need to tell the Unity to load the game pay, gameplay page. Okay, let's hit save. And uh, don't forget, we need to declare a button in here. And this time, we are not using the GUI. Uh, sorry, we are not using the texture 2D we will use GUI style. Why we are using GUI style? We will show you. Actually, we will show you why we are using GUI style later. So for, for the compare, we will put texture 2D in here and see how it looks like. Go back to the Unity. Okay, it's still loading. There's something wrong in here. We need to check. Okay, because uh, this format is not for texture 2D, so we can change the format just real quick. Copy this one and the paste. We're coming out this one, we will go back to this one later. So we are going to use this one as the play button. Go back to the Unity. So let's create a, a play button real quick. Let's save us. Uh, or the play button and we change this one to 64 by actually 128 by 128 
So let's clear everything in the image. It's simply just draw a play button in here. It's kind of ugly, but it's fine. Hit save. Go back to Unity. You can see the play button here again. We are going to change the GUI. Hit apply. Click on the game manager and drag the play button in here. So see how where it looks like. When we hit the play in here, you can see the play button. But the uh, little is a default frame on the outside. And if we don't want this one, we cannot use texture 2D. We have to use GUI style to remove the frame. So let's uh, uncomment this one and delete this line in here. Change this one to GUI style. And let's go back to here. See this will change. Change to the play button. And uh, you all you need to do is drag this one to here. Let's hit play again. So the frame is gone. So let's put something in here for debug. Yeah. Type print. And say and play page. Okay, let's we will see the result in here. We'll hit the play, you will see gameplay page shows up in here for the debug. And by the way, if you want to see the console panel in here, you can go window and there is a console panel in here. Then you can drag this console panel into this position or any position you like.